been outstanding this year. His kicking game is starting to get really good. He's one of those halves that isn't afraid to take you on, and as a middle guy, he keeps you honest. He's got that big step, and he can just cut through you. I think when you come into this environment, it's obviously we all play different teams, so you know it takes a week or two to get used to how each uh, individual plays. And as a half partnership, you know everyone's different, so we just have to make sure we buy into what Steve wants as the England coach and play to his structures. And you know we work really hard at training to get that right. At the end of the day, all the guys who direct the team around, obviously along with your your hooker there, so yeah, it's certainly vital that you have a, a, um, a half partnership that's working together well. Roby goes off and gets a pass to Williams, who looks for the step. Roby's left on the ground. Williams leaves defenders on the ground. It's had a tremendous year. It's quite hard being out um, in Australia. The games don't get televised too often, so it's quite hard. But from what I've seen, he's obviously young. He's still young, and um, he's a great, great ball runner. And, um, and I thought it was great on the weekend. I started playing for Melbourne when I was uh, 18, so you know I've been around some good players. Um, you know, in Billy Slur, Cameron Smith, I've learned a lot, and you know, it certainly helped me grow as a person. And now moving to the Dragons, being a little bit older, and we've got quite a young squad there, taking a bit more of a leadership role within that squad is something that I certainly enjoy. And like I said, my time over there has been great. I get a little bit of stick for the accent at times. Well, I've been there what, eight, nine, ten years now, so it, it's been a while. Um, hopefully, I don't ever lose it. A lot of the English players who have gone over there have had quite a lot of success and I guess it's probably the number one sport over there in Australia and the competition's great and I think the English players over here probably want to go out there and test themselves more and it's been a success um, so far and you know it's probably not the greatest thing for Super League losing their best players but for the international team I think it's great you get to play against you know the Australians, the Kiwis, the Samoans week in week out and um, I think that's great for England rugby league. My focus at the moment is obviously this year and you know, we've got a great opportunity ahead of ourselves in this, in this tournament and I think it's the first rugby league game to, to get played at that stadium so it's going to be incredible and especially down in London representing England is going to be a massive honour for myself and, and the team and everyone's really looking forward to it.